Hello there. It's been a while, hasn't it? So on today's video is about the Irish Republican Brotherhood. Now the IRB, Irish Republican Brotherhood, which was formerly known as Irish Revolutionary Brotherhood before, was founded on St. Patrick's Day 1858 by James Stevens in Peter Lanigan's Timber Yard, Lombard Street, Dublin. During the period of the 1850s and 1860s, it was known as the Fenian Movement. And the IRB, during this period, had a goal. And that goal was to create an independent, sovereign Irish Republic like its predecessors tried to achieve. Young Irelanders, 1840s, and the Society of United Irishmen in 1790s. The IRB was committed to use force, if need be, to create the Irish Republic, and it was organized into circles. The circle was a regiment. A was a colonel, can choose nine Bs, who are captains, in turn can choose nine Cs, who are sergeants, also can choose nine Ds, and they were the rank in file. Now the rule was A should be known by Bs, and B should be known by Cs, and C should be known by Ds. But apparently this rule was often violated. Now in the 1870s and 1880s, the IRB was trying to democratize the Home Rule League and the Irish Parliamentarian Party. The IRB also had involvement in the Land War of 1879. Now I will be doing a video about the Land War, same as the Home Rule League and the Irish Parliamentarian Party. But from the 1860s to before the 1916 rising, the members numbered 1300, and it had influenced and infiltrated organizations like the Gaelic League, Gaelic Athletic Association, Sinn Féin, Irish Industrial Committee, and from 1913 even influenced and infiltrated the Irish Volunteers. But at the start of the Irish Civil War in 1922 to 1923, the IRB split. After the Irish Civil War, Richard McCarthy reorganized the IRB in the Irish Free State Army. But with the Free State Army mutiny in 1924, the IRB disbanded. Now that is today's video. I hope to see you in the next one. So, slan.